Good morning, everybody. What's up? Welcome back to my channel. In that moment, I just remembered that, I guess, like, when you're watching this, it's not guaranteed that it's morning. So, hello, everybody. <laughs> What's up? Welcome back to my channel. So, oh my gosh, I forgot to grab my coffee. That's okay. Um, <laughs> today, as you saw by the title, we'll be doing my monthly makeup haul for the month of May. I know we're a few days out, but that's okay. Um, you guys still love these videos, so I wanted to make sure... It's gonna be one of them videos, isn't it? Um, so I wanted to make sure that I got it up. I did just get back from vacation a few days ago. I have been exhausted, honestly, honestly. And I've been sleeping in good. Like I haven't had much to do and I'm just like knocked at all times. Anyway, <laughs> first, if you guys like this video, definitely give it a thumbs up, hit the subscribe button. And without further ado, let's just get started. Um, I said this in, I think, my Tarte Custom Kit video, but I have so many videos planned, I just have to, like, you know, bang them all out. I am going on another, like, week-long vacation at the end of June. Um, I know. <laughs> I'm living my best life with no money. <laughs> um, but anyway, so, um, just so, so a heads up, so I'm gonna be, like, banging them out, and then they'll be, like pre-filmed just so you know um <laughs> so this month the month of may i tried to first i wanted to give myself a budget of like a hundred dollars for some reason this month i decided to like there were like four different videos that i decided to buy products for um and so there's that i didn't let's just say i didn't stick the goal anyway the first order i placed because i really want to get this out of the way um, I actually bought the M Cosmetics Divine Skies Eyeshadow Palette. Um, it's the Faded Clementine one, so I'll take it out for you. Um, but I'm gonna do a video, I promise that it's coming, of makeup you wanted me to try. It just took a little bit to get some of the products. I'm still waiting on a few responses. I don't have a completed full face. Um, so, you know, as of now, if you guys are seeing this and you have something, definitely let me know. I probably haven't filmed it, honestly. <laughs> um, but, um... This was just an eyeshadow palette that I was like, oh my gosh, yes. So, um, so freaking pretty. It just looks so much fun, and the shades look so delicious. And I've heard such amazing things about M, Com M Cosmetics. Now, this alone is like 45 This was $42 or something like that. So, I think I got a discount for it being my per first purchase. Um, because these are, like, expensive for no freaking reason for five shades. But everything about it is so stunning. So, I can't wait to use it. I just gonna wait for that video <laughs> but I was very excited about that I wanted to just buy that off the bat um and then uh, the other thing that I did while I had money still I picked up so this is from Italia Deluxe so someone had wanted me to try these um mousse matte lipsticks so I bought the mauve set they do have a nude set which I was gonna get but it was sold out at that time um but I do honestly I feel like you know mauves are in why not get this mauve set I honestly didn't need the set but I thought it would be more beneficial for you guys if I tried out multiple colors, especially on my tan tanner skin, um, so you guys can see, and you guys love like videos like that. And then I did pick up one single in the shade Terracotta, um, and that was in the nude set. Um, so I did get this one as well. That only all together though, it only cost me twenty dollars and forty five cents. This brand is not super expensive, and I think there might have been like a again a new shopper code. So that was really really nice as well. That brand is really inexpensive. I want to try more from them. Um, and then next, again, same, all the same video, <laughs> um, but this I wanted for, I've wanted for a while. It's the Physician Formula Butter Bronzer. It's the Murmur Butter Bronzer. Now, what I did was I actually bought this one in the shade, um, Deep Bronzer, and I don't know if it'll work for me. Um, so what I did, Jessica Braun actually said that, like, you know, on L Target's the website, they have the, they had the Earth Day, like, limited edition Physician Formula Collection. Um, and the butter bronzer is in a way thinner packaging, and so I actually ordered that, um, so it's on its way to me. Um, I just don't know which one I'm going to keep, because I know, obviously, you know, you won't be able to get that version anymore, but if they're the exact same, then I'll keep the smaller version and just tell you, like, obviously, you know, you can't get that version. Um, I, I haven't decided yet, but they're both, like, um, this is on 11 .99. I paid, but they're both, like, around, um, the 12 to $15 mark depending on where you get it honestly it's just physicians formula um but I am excited to try this again because I tried it a long time ago didn't get the right shade um but I don't I don't even know I don't even know I don't know why my voice is deciding to have a spouse die so I don't know I don't know what I'm gonna do <laughs> but I just wanted to let you know I did get both of those and I'm not gonna keep both all right and then I placed an Ulta order I only spent $22.26 the thing is here like again like the 
M Cosmetics ones are already $40 off the bat. So I was basically... Oh, that's what I did here. <laughs> so I was, I was already like $75 by the time I placed the Target order. And uh, that's only in counting one of the bronzers, you know? So then I placed an order. Uh, uh, then I went to Ulta and I actually wrote here makeup business gifts. So I did have a great makeup like weekend um, that weekend that I bought these. And so I count this as a gift to myself. So I paid with my makeup business money that I like to keep separate from my bank account. Um, just because I was like, oh, it's like a little treat to yourself. So I picked up a few NYX products. I did get the NYX Bear With Me Concealer. You guys know this has been all the rage right now. Um, I like it. I used it once. I don't really don't know how I feel. I think the shade was just bad for me when I bought it. So now it's going to be really great. <laughs> so um, I'm excited to keep trying it. I just, I'm not as excited as I feel like everyone else was. <laughs> I definitely bought this just for my full face of NYX. This is the Plump Finish um setting spray it's it's a really nice setting spray um it's not that bad i feel like it does really like do some plumping aspect to it and i don't know what it is but i did a whole video on it um if you guys want to check that out and then last of course i had to pick up another one of these elf no bud shadow sticks so i got the same champagne crystal i feel like it's just a little bit like more obviously champagne um i'll just swatch it i didn't want to swatch them because they really are no budge but I'll just move quickly. <laughs> the one that I had was Perfect Pearl, if you guys don't remember, even though I use it in every single video. So this is Perfect Pearl, and this is Champagne Crystal. You can see the difference here is just, you know, slight, but different enough that if I'm doing a more, like, gold look, I'll use Champagne Crystal. Now I'm doing more um, silver, kind of, like, white, lighter look, I'll use Perfect Pearl. So, um, wow. I don't know why I lost my channel out there. You guys know these are the love of my life. Um, and so I felt like, you know, I just, I deserved another one. I did. <laughs> there, I do want, I think, feel like I need, like, not that I need it, because I probably will never, like, use these up ever, but I would like, um, a more, um, pinkier one. So there is a rose gold one. I think it's, the shade is just rose gold. Um, and so that one I keep eyeing, but that was a fun little gift to myself. So that's not even including that in my price total. And this is, I'm so far over, it's not even funny. Okay. <laughs> then I placed the order at, I think, I don't even know what it's called. Sassy by Savannah. Savannah Chrisley. Um, I think it's her name. Again, this is another product that you guys wanted me to try. So again, it'll be all in that video. I haven't tried it yet. Um, but this only costs, like, I think it, uh, shipping is always expensive. The problem with, um, I, I think they're all indie brands, like, is the correct term, individually owned brands. Um, but these smaller brands that, like, you know, you don't hear a lot about, these brands are the ones with the shipping that are, like, $7, $8. And I was like, bro, like, so my $11 product just turned to 20 like, something dollars. So that's how, um, this one was. I think that's how the lipsticks were, too. Like, I probably would have got, maybe I got free shipping on the lipsticks. Anyway, there's a couple other orders that I haven't placed because I'm like, bro, I just, I only want to spend like the $10 and then it's like another 10 for shipping and I'm like, this is too much. But anyway, so this is the cutest little brow kit ever, honestly. So it's all, it's all eyes on me brow and lash kit. I got the shade medium dark. It's the cutest thing. So it does come with a mascara, which again, I haven't tried, but it's so super cute. And then it comes with, um... And then it does come with a um, double-ended, like, brow pencil, which I don't live for brow pencils. I would have rather, like, one side and it be, like, retractable. But, you know, we'll go ahead and try it because that's really cool. And then um, it does come with a brow wax, brow shaper wax stick, with, which I've never tried a wax stick. Um, but that could be fun and fresh, something, like, a lot easier than um, a brow soap kind of thing so we'll try that it, it does come with two cute little spoolies which i really appreciate because obviously the pencil doesn't have one <laughs> and then it does come with a tinted brow gel and this is in the shade again medium dark i haven't even opened this but Oof, that looks light but we'll give it a try um i would have rather do like a clear brow gel but you know it's okay it's okay so Anyway, such a cute little set here, and I thought, um, like, I need this in my life. It's only, I paid $17.34, which, again, I think the brow kit was only, like, $11 or something like that, so the rest was shipping. All right. And then Ulta did this crazy thing where I wanted to do, obviously, I'm trying to get it for a full face of NYX and a full face of makeup you want me to try. Again, if I had neither of those videos, I probably would not have bought 50% of these products. 
Um, but I'm so glad that he did because obviously I want to try new stuff and that kind of thing. So I'm really excited about it. I just, you know, obviously you have to spend money to do that. <laughs> but Ulta did actually, they were like reading my mind and they did a, um, if you spent a certain amount on NYX, I think it was only like $15, you got like five products for free, like in a like, little kit. So I was like, yes, I need that. They did a couple back to back and I skipped the first one because I was like, eh. And the second one I was like, oh, this is it. So um, I picked up. Uh, Oh, crap. oh, there it is. I picked up three different NYX products just so I could get it. First, I picked up the NYX This Is Juice Gloss. Again, this is another one of the makeup you guys wanted me to try. I could cry. I, I could cry and I could kiss you. And I hate I hate hugging and I hate kissing. I don't want to do it. Um, And I could hug you and I could kiss you because that's how excited I am about this gloss. My current favorite gloss. I can't put it down. It just lives in my purse. Let me, I'm not wearing it, but I'll just add a little bit. I was actually wearing the... um. What is it called? Uh, Winnie the Pooh X ColourPop, like, lip balm. Ugh, best decision I ever made. <laughs> that lip balm, too. But this one is just so freaking juicy, so pretty, so scrumptious. So I have other lip products, so I felt like you guys would be okay with me, like, trying this early. Um, and I'm so grateful that I did, because it's so good. You guys need it in your life. Oh, my gosh. So glad. I also picked up the NYX Lingerie uh, XX Extra Extra Large. Matte liquid lipstick. <laughs> so I got the shade Hot Caramello. Um, I want to do another video. I know. Um, duping my current favorite makeup. I don't know if I should swatch it or not because I want to see if this is a dupe for the Too, Fa Too Faced Cinnamon Bun um, liquid lipstick. But obviously, I'm just trying to wait for that video. Um, but I think what I'll do. I don't know. I haven't decided what I want to do. I don't know if I want to test them first or test them with you on camera. I don't know. I don't know. But I want to try this. Basically, and then I also picked up the NYX Sweet Shakes Matte Creamy Powder Blush. This I just wanted for my full face. Um, and someone commented on my video and was like, you guys are my, my blush declutter. And they are like, you have no blushes, girl. You need more blushes. Like, okay, challenge accepted. So I picked up this pretty freaking blush. Um, again, it's in the shade Citrine Rose. I didn't say that already. Um, it's dumb hard to open. I don't understand. I don't understand what I'm doing wrong. Goodness gracious, but it's like so freaking pretty. Oh my gosh, I think it would be so nice. It is a little bit lighter, like I wish it had a little bit more depth, but sometimes these are the ones that like surprise you. So very excited about those three. So then the five gifts that I got for uh, for free, which I got a full size of the NYX HD finishing powder, which I actually thought that this was a mini, and I was again happy with it. And then when it came full size, I literally was like, <gasps> what? So I have a whole mini of this thing. I have pan in it, like huge pan in it. I'm probably going to use it up soon, um, especially during these warmer months. So I'm so excited to have this full size. And then I also have, I don't know if this is a full size or a mini. It's five point, it's five grams. So I don't know if that's the full size. I think it is, honestly, of the NYX, um, the brow glue. And I've wanted to try this for so long. Again, I think this is a dupe for the, um, I'm hoping it's a dupe for the Makeup by Mario um, brow gel. Because I love that brow gel, but I'm almost done with it. And it's expensive. So um, I would love a drugstore alternative to that. So we're going to test that one out. And then this is the NYX Jumbo Eye Pencil Crayon. You guys have heard hundreds of thousands of things about this. So this is a great, like, eyeliner for the waterline or if you're doing something, you know, fun and fresh. So um, I'm going to definitely try that one. Um, now these two, I don't know if I'll try, but, um, you know, they came in this kit as well. So the, this is the NYX Pore Filler Primer. So I don't really use pore filling primers. I have three of them and I don't use them. This one could be a little different, which is I'm, I'm like, torn. But I'm, like, you know, someone will get better use out of it. Um, and then this is the NYX Filler Instincts Plumping Lip Polish in the shade Let's Glaze, um, which I don't, I would not mind another gloss, but I just, you know, I just have this NYX one. I have freaking 30 other glosses. I just did my inventory yesterday, and I have, like, so many glosses still, even though I just decluttered. And I feel like this one will just get lost in the sauce, so I don't necessarily need it. So while I'm giving stuff away, I might as well just give these away, you know? But I don't know. Um, either way... So exciting. Um, love that purchase. I paid $27.28 for that at Ulta um, for the three products here. Okay, I think it was $25 I had to spend for these three products here. Whew, yeah. All right, and then I did do the Tarte Custom Kit. My No, no, my timing's right with this one. Afterward, after this, my, my timing is a little all over the place. But I did get the Tarte Custom Kit, and I got five makeup products. So I did get the um, Tarte C Hydro Sealer. I'm excited about this. I really do like it. I've been liking it quite a bit. 
Um, and it's nice for my tan skin. <laughs> I also did get the Lights Camera Lashes Mascara, which I've been liking a lot so far. Um, I have to like re-fall in love with this because my beauty is going away. <laughs> um, I also got the Tarte Maracuja Juicy Lip Plump. I really love this as well. It's a great, 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 great lip product. I have the shade Primrose, um, which is a little bit lighter than I anticipated. It's a little bit lighter than my lips, but it is nice sometimes, so it's okay. Um, but it really does like tingle, plump up your lips. I love it, love it, love it. I do wish that they changed the... So these are like the regular Maracuja Juicy Lips. I wish that maybe they changed the cap instead of the bottom. Because like even if it's laying down, you could still see the cap and the bottom's the same. Um, or the shades, you could see them like if, you, if that's the idea, like if they're laying down. For me, I stand mine up though and I can't... I have to like pull them out still. So it's me being bougie, but I wish the caps were different. <laughs> And then I did get the Tarte Tartlet, um, like, eyeshadow palette. They just call it the Tarte Tartlet eyeshadow palette. And I'm like, when you look up Tarte Tartlet eyeshadow palette, it's not this, like, when I'm trying to do my thumbnails. Anyway, this is so freaking pretty. I love this so, so much. Oh, my gosh. It just is perfection. And I didn't know Tarte could do something so good, honestly, because their eyeshadow formula is never, like, 10 out of 10. Sometimes it's really good, but never, like, you know, hit the mark, but this shimmer is so pretty. It's very light. It's very aesthetically, like, correct. Like, with this palette, it's very, like, natural light. It's nothing too, like, shining luminous, but, um, but you can build it up. If you build it up quite a bit, it's, like, a uh, prettier look. So, um, I love this palette. I think everyone needs one of these in their life. Come on. You all need one of these in your life. Shining, shining, splendid. And then I also have the Tarte I mean, Amazonian Clay 12 Hour Blush in the shade Natural Beauty. I got another blush, um, but so freaking stunning. Like, honestly, wow, these are, like, pretty similar. I think Citrine Rose is a little bit more peach. Um, but the, this one is really nice because it's, like, gives you that, like, really pretty sunburnt look. Sunburnt, suntan, kind of, like, just, like, the sun kissed you just a little bit. Like, not super sunburnt, obviously, but, like, you know, just kissed you a little bit. And I love, love, love it. Oh my gosh, NYX, this is going to drive me nuts. Why can't this open normally? And it really does last like 10, 12 hour days because I wore it at Disney and it did not move all day and I shook to the core. Um, wow, that was horrible. Yeah, they're definitely different. This one's a little bit more peach, but I just meant I wanted to show you that so that you guys could see like, like a blush that looks like some bright sometimes has some depth to it for the tan skin girls, and that's this Tarte one for sure. So um, Tarte blushes are kind of expensive, but if you have the chance to see it on sale or something, I say get it. Um, so those are the products I got in my Tarte custom kit. The Tarte custom kit is always like expensive. <laughs> it's sixty. I paid sixty eight dollars and ninety sixty eight dollars and ninety cents. Um, so you pay quite a lot for it, but you know, yellow. All right, so we have a few that I did at the end of the month. This one fell in here somewhere. I just don't know specifically, but I did pick up the NYX Ultimate um, Edit Eyeshadow Palette in the shade Phoenix. This was like two dollars um, um, in the Phoenix one. Two dollars on my Target, so I was like, yes, I need an eyeshadow palette from NYX. I don't love all the NYX formulas. I honestly don't want to pay eighteen dollars for one of NYX palettes. Um, I just, you know, I was just like, I mean, uh, their color schemes didn't speak to me. So I was just like, you know, let me just grab it because it's $2. So that's what I did for this one. And it looks kind of fun. You know, I could use this as like um, um, a palette, like a combination palette. So that could be nice just to add some depth or some fun to some other palettes. So I thought that it was useful for $2. <laughs> I know, it's so bad, but I just, I was like, whatever. And then, again, the order's a little messed up, but I did place a Beauty Creations um, order. This is another one of makeup you guys wanted me to try. Um, a setting spray. So I got a little kit that had, like, a primer, a setting spray, and then, like, another primer that I'll probably get rid of when I get rid of the other um, stuff. Um, but, yes. <laughs> so I picked up that. I only paid, I paid $17.08, which, again, the set was, like, $12. So um, I don't know how I got up to $17.08, but um very ridiculous <laughs> it's shipping man it's shipping but anyway i just wanted to show you guys quickly what was in the beauty creations bag little thing that i got so it's a fall stay all day like set so it comes with this cute bag and then a few goodies in there so this is the setting spray i want to try it's the flawless day setting spray for all skin types um it's just a cute little mini here this i thought was much bigger but <laughs> i thought it was at least the same size as the Setting spray and it's way smaller. 
but this is for high it's a hygiene primer um oil free dewy finish so something i would like this i don't know if i'll like or even try because it's a primer stick it's matte and i don't do matte but maybe it'll be nice for summer i just i don't know i have quite a few of these the kind of matte more mattifying or pore filling kind of primers so don't necessarily need this but we'll see and then a cute little sponge i think it just got dented but <laughs> oh freak but it's cute so that was in that package so at this point in like cost i'm at like 205 dollars 200 and something dollars um until yes now again basically the m cosmetics palette between the m cosmetics palette and the tarte custom kit i'm already over budget so whatever um so i really don't mind that much i just i think next month i have to so my birthday month is i always go ham just so we're clear so next month will always be the the june the haul will always be the the biggest last year was like 500 dollars. i know um so obscene but this year i just i want to be able to spend what i want to spend but i want to so this next month i think my goal instead of like a money goal will just be like um to sp <laughs> to like buy it all outright so i use clarina and afterpay like nobody's business like i just go here and I'm on behind that. I, it's not behind. I just have so many payments coming up. And like every day I have someone like it charges me. Because obviously like I, I just buy, you know, just every two weeks. So anyway, <laughs> I have to like pay, make sure that's paid off. And then I have to um, like stop using it. So like, like normally I feel like I have to like make that a, like if I really want something and really don't have the money, then use that. Um, but like now it's just like the only way I check out and it's a horrible, horrible way to do that thing. So don't, don't do as I say, not as I do. Um, <laughs> but anyway, so I think that will be my goal next month to just buy things outright, like just pay full and, or that's it, you know, like, or don't get it, you know, that kind of thing. But anyway, this was already justified with my birthday haul and I did use like after pay, um, but I needed it. So I was like, I'm getting it. Um, <laughs> this is the, uh, new Jacqueline Cosmetics product. So I didn't get the stupid eyeshadow palette because to me it looked dumb, but anyway you can tell it's early because i just have no filter um but i picked up the jacqueline x robin all set setting spray i'm so excited i sprayed this at morphe the morphe store a while back and i just i knew i needed it in my life um i cannot wait to freaking use this i don't know what i'm waiting for honestly i, I really truly don't but um <laughs> i'm very excited about it and then um i have the powder move loose setting powder in the shade sheer light i got sheer light because all my other setting powders are that i use loose setting powder under my eye i know some people are backwards um but this one might be one i don't know but it still looks like kind of deep in there i don't know it might not work on my face now but it definitely would have worked on my face before which is why i'm glad i picked up sheer light um but the packaging i love her packaging and so excited her pressed powder is the truest love of my life so i feel like this this just cannot drop the ball for me. I picked up those two, and then I also did pick up the Milani Anti Gravity. Um, Jessica Braun has been obsessed with this, but I didn't want to open it. Um, but I thought that it would be a nice dupe to the By Beauty Upswing, just in effect, uh, not the same exact ones. Um, but long story short, a lot of the products that I love and that are like my number ones have a special ingredient that, like, they're not all the same special ingredient, but they all have unique ingredients that most products don't have which is why they're so good and i was like mind blown at this because no one talks about this or i just don't follow the people who do talk about it um but honestly i don't think anyone's talked about it <laughs> because they're like like a specific oil or specific this a specific vitamin like only like the, the products that i love have those and i was shocked to the core shook to the core um anyway milani had a, something similar to the bite beauty so i was like we'll go ahead and try them and then jessica braun has been loving this one and the bite beauty so i felt like to me that that connected in my brain if they're both that good to be like her favorites maybe there's something similar about them so we'll see <laughs> i do have the little pack stupid packaging but whatever all right that is it for this video guys now that one was justified with my birthday haul so you will probably see it in a birthday haul video um in a few weeks just because that's the only reason i bought it i was like it's my birthday coming up i want it to be here for my birthday and i want to love it for my birthday so <laughs> um that's why i picked those products up but anyway um i spent 278 dollars and 23 cents i know and there's already a purchase for june Ay, ay, ay. It's okay.
We're doing big things. Um, I'm excited to home for next month. Um, I'm going to try to stick to the goal. I'll have to write it down right now and just be like, no afterplay, no clarinet. Yeah. <laughs> All right, guys. That is it for this video. I really hope you enjoyed it. I'm sorry I sat down so low. Ugh. It's just, you know, the hard knock life. Anyway, um, I hope you guys really enjoyed it. I'm sorry I'm also not wearing any makeup. I just didn't feel like putting any on and I was living that glowy beautiful life and you want to know what I have on my face I only have the elf SPF 30 like moisturizer that's the only thing I have on and I look delicious so get it while you can <laughs> I'll see you in the next one bye guys